here that have put so many hours and hours of hard work in putting this event together for our community. And I want to personally thank each and one of every one of you for coming out here tonight because your money is going for a good cause. I'd like to introduce Jill Ripp, our Deputy Executive Director, and she'll tell you a little about where your monies are going. Hello, everybody. Is Web fabulous this year or what? Whoa! Fantastic. Um, I just want to let you know we always want to give you a good time at the Web Party, and we're indoors this year, thankfully, so we don't care whether it rains or not. Um, but in addition to that, it is really spectacular. It's a good way to have a fun time, but it's a very critical event for us as a fundraiser to raise critically needed dollars for the San Antonio AIDS Foundation. I know many of you know about the AIDS Foundation and what we do, but I just want to tell you about a few of our newer programs that you might not know about. One, which went into effect since the last web party last year, as you may or may not know, uh, Casa Martin Home Action Care closed down their shelter, which was the only HIV-dedicated shelter in San Antonio. And so the San Antonio AIDS Foundation stepped up to the plate, and miraculously, we were able to identify a building around the corner from the San Antonio AIDS Foundation within two weeks' time of the closing of Casa Martin. And on August 1st, we opened the Carson House. And it is a transitional shelter that houses up to 20 male, female, and transgender clients who are HIV infected for up to 90 days while they can work things out to try to either get an income or in the meantime find other subsidized housing. So we are really proud of that. And your dollars help support that from this evening. And in addition to that, our HIV testing and education program has expanded dramatically over the last year. We went from 2,000 HIV tests to over 3,000 HIV tests last year, and we hope to do even more because, as we know, there is still no cure for AIDS, but prevention is the best tool that we have. So we want everybody who is age 13 to 64 who has ever been put themselves at risk, they need to come and do an HIV test to find out their status. Okay, thank you, Jill. We, at first, uh, have a couple special awards to give out this evening before uh, we bring on our special guests and before the fabulous show starts. At first, and um, Jill, why don't you tell us who it is? Judy Medina, who has been the volunteer coordinator extraordinaire for seven years for the web party. So if Judy is here, if she can come forward. Thank you so much. We couldn't do it without you. Um, our second award is to R.B. Blackstone, who does the sound and electric and lights the last three years and has saved our skin many, many times. And he's a newly married man. So, R.B., where are you? We'll give them a minute to come up. In the meantime, thank you so much. I'd like to thank the Academy. Um, our third award is to Gabriel Sanchez, who's both a member of our board but also the volunteer coordinator for the last two years. He's been keeping all the volunteers in line and doing a huge, wonderful job. So Gabriel, are you here? Thank you. And our final two awards go to one to Steven Sadler, and one to Leonard Juarez. They have done the show and all the costumes for the last three years. And be sure to stick around for the show because it is going to be incredible. 
So they deserve a huge round of applause for their efforts. Where are they? Stephen and Leonard? Here they come. What you need to know is that to put these shows on, we've had volunteers who have volunteered their time over the last three months to get the show together, and over the last three weeks, they have been working every night so that you can have a great show tonight. And I want to also give a special thanks to Alan Beckstead and his team. Alan is a member of our board, our former board president. And he is responsible for all the incredible decorations tonight. So thank you, Alan, and your team. Okay. Um, I'd now like to welcome our special guests. We're very, very pleased tonight that we got two high city official and county officials here this evening with us. And first of all, I'd like to introduce Bear County Sheriff Ortiz for coming. And I want to thank him for coming to our party. Everybody having a good time? It's a great party, great venue. I think you could get half of San Antonio inside this building. And, and you don't get in the rain, so it's a great place. And it's a great cause. I, I just want to make sure that everybody has a safe fiesta. We'll be here throughout. Uh, we have officers working. If you need anything at all, just uh, contact your officers and they'll help you. Be careful, be safe, and I'm humbled and, and proud to be here with you all today. So have a great time. Thank you, Sheriff. We appreciate it so much. Thank you. And our second guest this evening is Chief McManus, and we're so happy to have him here. Our Chief of Police in San Antonio, Texas. Welcome, Chief. Thank you. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. I want to tell you a quick story, if you'll bear with me for just a couple minutes. I moved to Washington, D.C. back in the 70s, early 70s, and I met a guy by the name of David Copay. Anybody know David Copay? Know who he is? David Copay was the first NFL football player to come out. I met him when I was working out one day and got to know him over the years and became very good friends with him. And through that friendship, I met a guy by the name of Jerry Smith. Jerry Smith was also a, an NFL football player. He played for the Washington Redskins. And I heard one day that he died. And I went to his funeral along with Dave Copay, and I learned that Jerry Smith was a gay man who played in the NFL for years, never came out, and he died of AIDS. And when I saw the devastation that it caused his family, his friends, and everyone that knew him, it affected me and made me understand how it feels to lose somebody to that disease, lose a friend to that disease. I say all that to say to you that I am with you and I am here to serve you. Thank you very much. Thank you, Chief. We appreciate you coming. Thank you very much. Are you ready to pull? 